I'm going to show you an easy way to close caption a DVD inside Adobe Encore. Before we start, we have to make sure that we've already exported our .scc file from Caption Maker or Mac Caption software. Then we're ready to import our audio and video. Typically, when we digitize a video, it's going to be in the AVI DV format or an uncompressed AVI format. DVD Studio Pro and DVD Encore both support QuickTimes and AVIs. Let's import our AVI. Import by right-clicking on the Asset Bin or the Project Bin. Select Asset and let's bring in our AVI. Hit Open and here it is. You can see that the AVI contains our video. Next, we're going to imp make a new uh, timeline. There we go. And then we're going to drag and drop our video into that timeline. This timeline uh, is very similar to an editing timeline, except that it's not going to be for editing, but rather for DVD authoring. OK. Next, we're ready to apply our SEC file or captions to um, the DVD streams. By pressing the control button on your keyboard, we can click on just the video stream over here. Notice when I clicked on that, we got this particular window, Properties. And in this window, we have options to import closed captions, or Field 1 and Field 2. In this case, we only have field 1 or CC1. Let's browse for our SEC file. Hit Browse. Desktop. Here's our SEC file. Hit Open. And that's how you apply closed captions to uh, the video in DVD Encore. At this point, you're ready to burn it, unless you want to do some authoring with menus. You burn it by going to File, select Build DVD, and then select a DVD disk. This will basically give you the option to actually burn the DVD in this window. Here we go. Gives you the recorder we want to burn it to. What kind of project? And I hit build. Once we hit build, it's going to prompt you for a blank DVD. And then you can do the burn. 